I'm Dr. Herman from New York City and you're watching the Plastic Surgery Channel. A new survey shows that cosmetic surgery on drooping eyelids can improve quality of life. The operation is called blepharoplasty. It rejuvenates aging eyelids by removing and repositioning extra fat, skin, and muscle, which can accumulate with age. Having eyelids like this can also impair vision. Researchers questioned 26 adults who were undergoing cosmetic surgery on their upper and lower eyelids. They learned that all of the patients were having this procedure done to improve not just their appearance, but also their self-esteem, and that it worked. This suggests that among older patients, eyelid surgery can be one of the most effective procedures to make them feel good about their looks. Meanwhile, the company that produces Botox is trying to prevent the Food and Drug Administration from telling them how to market their product. Right now, Botox is approved for treating eye muscle problems and neck pain in addition to smoothing wrinkles. But the FDA is reportedly trying to prevent drug company Allergan from also advertising Botox as a treatment for arm and leg spasms. Such use is not yet regulated. Still, company representatives said Allergan would file a court order allowing it to release information about proper dosage and injection techniques regarding these unregulated muscle treatments. With regard to the legal action, Allergan's Chief Administrative Officer and Secretary Douglas Ingram stated, quote, In the lawsuit, Allergan argues that the government's legal position that it is a crime for a pharmaceutical company to communicate truthful information about off-label uses of its products to physicians violates the First Amendment and is inconsistent with the Food, Drug, and Cosmetic Act. Robust exchange of truthful and relevant safety and efficacy information of drugs regardless of their on- or off-label use, is essential to the advancement of medicine and quality of patient care. Earlier this year, the FDA ordered Allergan to increase the box label warnings about the side effects of Botox, which can include muscle weakness. It's time for a quick break, but we'll be right back with more plastic surgery news, including a national program that offers discounted plastic surgery to injured war veterans. We'll be right back. Did you know that breast implants can explode in an airplane? Really? I didn't know that. You know, you can donate the excess skin from your tummy tuck to the Shriners. I can? My doctor said Botox would get rid of your acne. Oh, that's fantastic. The Myth Files. Dissecting truth from fiction in plastic surgery. <laughs> 